Ooh, that's a little spotted bass. Look at it, y'all. Pretty. Morning, guys. How's it going? Today, we're gonna go on a little adventure. Looking for a few new fishing spots around. Uh, I'm gonna be using Google Earth just to scan around, see any bodies of water I might be able to catch a few fish out of, little creeks here and there. Should be kind of fun. All right, little babies, got my gear. Let's go down here and see what's up. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I see some bluegill action already. Oh yeah. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think this is a green sunfish. All right, guys, I'm not really catching anything over here except I keep on catching like little small bluegill. I haven't caught any bass or anything like that. So, all right, guys, that's it for this spot. Uh, I will come back to this spot though once once it rains more. I could tell that once the water is higher, there's some. Good fishing spots over here. How's it going guys? Back for another spot. We bought some more company today. She don't like fishing. I don't know why she can. Oh, look. Uh, what do you mean? Uh, you got them, look. Uh, like it. Uh, a bass? No, catfish. Catfish. Uh, yeah, catfish. That's fishy for me. Don't catch it, Daddy. You want to tell them about the fish you caught? Yeah, I caught catfish. How big was it? Uh, not that big. You want to try to catch another one? Yeah, because my catfish jumped out. <laughs> okay. Alright guys, I'm probably going to call it a day. There's not much fish in here. There's no bass. There's a few catfish and some bluegill. That's about it. What's up, y'all? We done came over here to... China, Texas, today park looks a lot more promising over here. And we're going to see what we can get into. I was Texas rigging a lunker log. I wasn't getting nothing. I put on a little Bama bug, black and blue, wacky rig. Hey. Shauna Park, y'all. Shauna Park. Doing some river fishing here at the Hell's Gate Bridge. See what we can get into. First fish. All right, guys, this is the next creek, County Road 420. 
had to go back and get some company. And we're gonna try to get on some fish, yeah? How you doing guys? Fishing? Frozen pole? And all we've caught so far is a turtle. <laughs> a big turtle. But yeah, I got something. Got one. You can fill this up with water somehow. Yes, I'll come right here. Alright guys, I found another spot. But ain't no water in there. So I'm walking up and down to see if I find any deep pools. Or any bass or anything might be held up. But I'm not finding much. I'll get back to y'all if I find a little pool or something. Just gonna go find the next spot. There's some little bass right there if you can see. I don't know if y'all can see them, but you see them? They hold up under that rock right there. But they're probably like a few inches long. See y'all at the next spot. Finna go back. Alright y'all, here's another spot I just seen. But as you can see, there ain't no water in here either. Finna walk down a bit and see if I can find any pools again. But it ain't looking like it. I'll get back to y'all though. Yeah, this looks like about as deep as it's going to get. There's some, a lot of little bluegill in there. There's a big one over there. But, I'm not trying to catch no bluegill. I'm going to go look the other way right quick. If it ain't nothing here, I'm going to move on. Whoop. There was nothing but little, little bluegills right there. No bass. No bass. So, it's already about 8.20. Go ahead and call it a day on the search. But, we will continue till we find somewhere with some bass. Stay tuned. Alright y'all, I'm at another creek pretty damn dry I'm walking down the creek to see if I can find any holes it looks like one right in front of me check this out might be able to wade through it find a deeper hole let's check things out as you can see it's about two feet deep right here there was some little tiny bass hooked uh, under this log. I hooked one up and I fucking lost it. So I ruined it. Now they're gone. Oh well. Let's move on. Cash right there right quick. Look like a tasty spot. All I'm throwing is this little cheap ass little grub right here. I mean it's a little, little bitty creek so I ain't gonna throw nothing too big because I don't expect any monsters in here so ultralight rock let's get on this little hill and make a little cast under that tree see what we can do look I don't know if y'all can see it but <laughs> it's like 
ten of them hoes chasing my little worm. Hundreds, I'm telling you, in this little pool right here, there's at least a hundred bluegill. They're small, like about two, three inches, but them motherfuckers are here. So, there gotta be a bass somewhere. I'm gonna try to find them. When I find them, I'm gonna catch them. Hey little bass, you want to come home with me, go to my pond? Huh? Huh? Come on. Come on little bass. Hey, that's my foot. That's my foot. Ooh, that's a little spotted bass. Look at it y'all. Pretty. Have y'all ever seen a bass come up to somebody's foot and explore it? Look at it. That's cool. See you later, guy. I'm gonna come catch you when you get bigger. I'm gonna come get you. Oh, that was pretty tight. Well, guys, I made it all the way to the next bridge. This is on uh, Highway 77. This is the biggest pool I found so far, but it's still not that deep. It's about two and a half feet. It goes a little over my knees. There's a couple of deep spots over there that might be like three feet, but that's about it. And just a bunch of bluegills still, no bass. I could see into the water, so I don't see any. Just see a bunch of bluegill. Uh, next time I might come back and do the other side. I know there's supposed to be a hole on the other side, but I'm gonna go ahead and call it a call it a day at this creek. Catch y'all at the next one. We back at the Shiner Park again, guys. You know what I'm talking about? It's about 5:45, 6 o'clock in the morning. You know what I'm saying? Finna see if we can catch us a little bass on some top water action. You feel me? But yeah, water's calm, weather's hot and muggy. Let's get to it. Got us one, guys. He's not huge, but he's nice. Got another one, guys. Shining Park again. Comes through. Alright, guys. He's still alive, doing good. Fixing to release them into the pond. Every fish that you've seen me catch on this video, I have released into my pond at home. Uh, so far, what is that? So this is going to be the third bass, two channel cat, two bullhead cat, and about six or seven bluegill, something like that. But yeah, I'm trying to rejuvenate this pond. It had dried up like a couple years ago and all the fish died, so I'm reintroducing fish into it and they all seem to be doing good. I be seeing the big bass swimming around and everything's great. Uh, there's not much water now. We're praying for some rain because it is August in Texas and y'all know what that means, but hopefully we get a good rain and Anyways, let's release this guy. There he goes. Usually, I would get him acclimated to the temperature of the water, but since it's about it's about 6:45 in the morning right now 
7 o'clock. The water is cold anyway, so he did real good. He just swam right off. And it's another bass, baby. This will be bass heaven one day. Y'all gonna come out here and catch some monsters. But I'll fuck with y'all in the next video.